everyone. Welcome to Linda's Thrifty Life. Your eyes do not deceive you. I am a mess. <laughs> it's just how it is today. I um, I just, uh, I have to get ready to take mom back to the um, dentist to work on her dentures. But before I do that, I thought I'd pop out and give you a little update on what's going on and a little Dollar Tree share. And I mean a little Dollar Tree. So, Sunday I took Scout shopping. We went to Target. She is just delightful. She really is. She loves to look at everything. She's not grabby or whiny, and she looks and touches gently, and then we go back through for a second round, and then she starts picking what she decides to buy. And um, she's just a good little shopper, so I was real proud of her. We had a lot of fun. The only thing I found there was um, in the little dollar spot, I found these chalk markers. So that's, whoops, what Grandma bought. And that was it. <laughs> that was it from, from, uh, from Target. And so then we, we said, I said, well, let's run by... Um, I said, let's run by Dollar Tree because Grandma needs to look for a couple of things. So we did, and she bought one thing. She picked out one thing, some lip gloss, and it turned out to be this bright red. We thought it was just like a lip, you know, sheer thing with a little color. Oh, no, it was bright red. <laughs> but it was in the shape of a popsicle, so it was cute, and she took it home. So the first thing I found when we went in was... Look at this. I got a Tilly the Turtle. I never got one last year when these came out. And they're so cute. And I don't need it. I don't need this. But it is adorable. Look at that. Look at Tilly the Turtle. And she can hold stuff. I might get a plant. Although I've been tending to kill them lately or Annie eats them. But I just... I just had to. It just made me happy. And Scout thought it was cute. <laughs> so, and then I got, and, and we keep these in my window when Scout comes over. She loves to make sure that they get the sun. But look at this. Isn't that adorable? They had some other cute ones, but this is, of course, I had to get the flamingo. So, I might put it in the window and see. Although, I will tell you that the clicky clack drives me nuts. <laughs> So, let's see. I didn't get a whole lot of stuff. I did um, get a banner. I want to make some banner things. And I just thought this would be fun. It was already cut out. I was going to do this for Sweet Tea and Grace. But it's not the right size. But I might add something to it so I can enter her challenge. I'm so far behind on everything. Then I found another um, tape measure so that I can keep one in here and one in the other room so I don't have to look for it all the time. So this one will stay in here. These are great little tape measures. I got some of my um, Trolley Sour, Sour Bright crawlers. I just love these sour things. I know, crazy. I got two of these little Rubbermaid bowls with the, I already took the little packaging off of them because I wanted to, I was going to use one the other day, but it's such a good size for just a lot of leftovers or, or things, and I, I don't have a lot of little bowls for the refrigerator. I got this basket. Um, they finally had some new baskets in, and this one I think I'm going to put all of my um, greeting cards that I make or others have sent me to to use and hopefully we'll make some more and maybe I will um if they're handier I will use them or make more <laughs> and then in the beauty area I got these now these are supposed to like make the end of your hair curl so I only got one package to give it a try I've heard some of you say these are really um fun and um I'll see. You know, before a dollar, I thought I couldn't go wrong. And then this, I saw my friend Janae, Janae's Eclectic um, Universe. She hauled this, and so I was looking for it. This was the one thing I really went in there to see if I could find. And it's called a wrap-up, and it makes, if 
I don't throw it around, it supposedly makes helps you make a bun on top of your head, which I could use because right now I just have it clipped up and it's wild lady. I do have cat ears on. <laughs> so, so that was my pick, you know. That was it at Dollar Tree. My craft section had nothing new. Um, the stickers were, they had a lot of stickers, but they were, you know, ones I've already purchased or don't want. And I still have never found the little clear stamps nor the die cuts except for that one. And um, this was my large Dollar Tree. And I'm telling you, it has really, really um, just, it's a mess. It's gone downhill and they're looking for employees. So hopefully they find some people to work there and they, they get some stuff done. And before I go, I wanted to share with you one other thing I purchased. This is a new corner rounder. And I saw uh, Mel, uh, she shared this was one of her favorite crafting um, tools from um, uh, Everything Marmy. And it, she got it on Amazon, and so I ordered it. You know, can't read any of that. But I found it. It's Kodomaru. And what I like about it is it's got uh, small, medium, and large. And I tried it out, and it's really, it's really easy to use. And so you can corner around three different sizes of corners. Just a tiny bit, a little bit more, or more, more. So I've tried, I've used it a few times. I really like it. So um, I, I will leave the link below. I think it was, I want to say it was like about $10 and um, well worth it, well worth it. My other corner rounder, which is really old and from Creative Memories, it's starting to get a little worn. I have bought some from Hobby Lobby and have not been happy with them. So this one is awesome. Really happy with it. So, what else is going on? Today, Mom and I go back for um, a um, an adjustment to her dentures. Please, 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 let's hope that this works. It's, it's just, oh, it's so hard. She's had such a hard time. She is still not feeling really well. Um, we've been to the doctor. Um, she has a CT scan um, scheduled for next week. She's had this pain in her side, in her left side. So, um, anyway, you know, I just get concerned and, uh, but she's, she's doing okay. Um, we will, hopefully if she gets her dentures where she can, um, eat without any kind of pain, she will be a happy lady. <laughs> and so will I. So, I am trying to catch up on some um, entries to challenges I want to do, and I am trying to get my mail out. Um, hopefully, I have a I have a uh, Thursday is a day Thursday or Friday I should say that because you know how my life is Thursday or Friday I plan to get um, packages to the mail. So, uh, Linda Magruder, your Hello Kitty package, and hopefully some other little friend mail. And if, oh, oh, big cross fingers, I can get these challenges done in the next couple of days, then I will get them out in the mail also. So, um, I had one of those days yesterday where I just absolutely could not stay awake. I slept all day long on the couch. Every, uh, every time I turned around, I was just falling asleep, and I'd wake up, and it'd be like, 30 minutes later or 20 minutes later and and then um I ended up sleeping for two hours and then I started with the body aches and I was like no lord please I don't want fibro and um you know I prayed about it and I um started feeling better so um I never did get the body aches so I am so grateful for that I did sleep like a crazed person, but my body just requires that now after I have a couple of busy days like I did over the weekend. It's a very big adjustment for me. Um, sometimes I do better than others with accepting my limitations. So um, I thank you all so much for your support and of me, my, talent, my channel, 
my mom, my grandkids, my whole family. You're just all so kind and sweet, and you just don't know how much it all means to me. So I hope I'll see you soon. Bye.